hey what's going on guys let's do this problem right here this question is asking steel rods are heated in a furnace to 850 degrees celsius and then quenched in a water bath at 50 degrees celsius for a period of 40 seconds as a part of hardening process the convection heat transfer coefficient is 650 if the steel rods have diameter of 4 millimeter and length of 2 meter determine their average temperature when they are taken out of the water bath now let's see how we can find this one to find this one we can use lump system analysis equation that is e power minus bt is equivalent to t t so this is temperature at time minus ambient temperature over t initial minus ambient temperature right so this is the one we are trying to find temperature at time now in order to find this one in order to use this equation first of all we had to see whether this is a lump system right because this is a lump system analysis equation so to find the lump system what we do is we take the biot number we check the biot number and see whether the, that is less than 0 0.1 so biot number should be less than 0 0.1 so let's go ahead and check it to find that one we use this equation that is HLC over K H is heat transfer coefficient K is thermal conductivity L is, LC is a characteristic length right so H is heat transfer coefficient that's provided right here K is thermal conductivity that's provided right here but characteristic length we have to find that one out to find that we have to use this equation LC is equal to volume of a surface area so here this is a cylindrical shape right steel rod it's a cylindrical shape so whenever we have cylindrical shape we can use this ratio this if you find this one out that ratio is going to be d by 4 you can plug the equation and check that one out like uh, for volume in a cylindrical shape that's going to be 5d square over 4l 4 times l and then surface area is going to be 5l and if you solve this one you will get d over 4 so instead of solving we, we can always use this one so this is going to be it and we know the diameter here that's provided 40 millimeter so that's going to be 0 0.04 meter right divided by 4 and if you solve this solve for this one this is going to be 0 0.01 meter now we have the characteristic length now we can find the biot number so to find the biot number we plug this value that is this one 650 heat transfer coefficient 650 times LC that is 0 0.01 over K thermal conductivity that's provided right here that's 63.9 and if you solve for this one that will give you 0 0.102 and we have to have biot number less than 0 0.1 but this is almost 0 point so it's very near to 0 0.1 so we can still use this one as a lump system right so this is almost equivalent to 0 0.1 so we can still use this one as a lump system now since this is passing the lump system analysis we can use this lump system analysis equation test right so we can use this uh, equation to find solve for this one now let's check whether we have all the information to do this right so first of all we have to have t infinity that's ambient temperature that's right here and initial temperature is provided right here so these are the thing we need in this uh, in this side and the in the other side we need b and t and we know the time is 40 seconds so we have the time but we, we don't have the b b is basically time constant like 1 over b is time constant b is reciprocal of that one to find b what we do we use this equation b is equal to h a s over rho c p v right so here h is heat transfer coefficient surface area rho is density c p is specific heat and v is volume and we know that v over a s is equal to l c right but here we have a so v that's this is reciprocal of this one so we can replace this one with 1 over l c so if we replace we will get 1 uh, h over rho cp times lc so we this is going to be our new equation 
now we can go ahead and plug our values so first we have heat transfer coefficient that's provided right here 650 over density that is right here density and specific heat are right here so density is 7832 so 7832 and specific heat is 434 and let's see we found out that is 0 0.01 and if you solve for this one that's going to give you 0 0.01912 second minus one right now we have all the information now we can find out this value now let's go ahead and plug the values so first we have e power minus vt so minus b value is 0 0.01912 times t time is 4 seconds actually 40 seconds so this is going to be 40 and t t that's what we are trying to find minus t infinity that is ambient temperature that is 50 degrees celsius over t initial is 850 minus 50 right and if you solve for this t actually i have to write this one like t bracket t t like this right so t t is going to be equal to 422.3 degrees celsius and that's going to be our final answer i hope you guys find this video helpful see you next time